Knowing exactly where hurricanes will go, it's a tricky business. When the National Hurricane Center issues forecasts, it uses a cone to project where the probable center of the storm will be over time. The cone is formed by enclosing the projected forecast area by circles at various points in time. The size of each circle is determined so that two-thirds of the five-year historical forecast errors fall within the circle. Let me explain. Two-thirds of the storms over the past five years wound up within 46 miles of where the storm was forecast to be out 24 hours. You go 48 hours out, the storms, two-thirds of the time, they fell within 79 miles. The farther out you go, the bigger the circle gets. By the time you get out 120 hours or five days, the circle encompassing two-thirds of the storms expands to have a radius of 240 miles. Now you simply connect those forecast circles and you get the area that's most likely to have the center of the storm over the coming days, making the cone of uncertainty. While the cone projects the probable track and timing of the center of the system, it's important to remember what it does not tell us. It doesn't speak to the size, the intensity, or the structure of the system. You'll need to turn to trusted meteorologists and the National Hurricane Center for information on that.